Hello, my friends, and welcome back. It is Thursday, March 4th, 2020. This is 2020. I'm the drunk pokeroo. It is seltzer time. Hard seltzer time. Hard seltzer. White Claw. Uh, took the states by storm the last uh, year or so, maybe. Uh, actually created by the same guy that created Mike's Hard Lemonade here in Canada. He's a Canadian billionaire. Uh, basically, it is hard seltzer water. Uh, it's... Uh, <laughs> I don't know how to describe it any other way. It's sparkling seltzer water made with cane sugar, fermented, and fruit flavor added. There's three flavors here in Canada. There's lime, there's black cherry, and the one I'm going to try is mango. Uh, 140 calories, 5% ABV. <sighs> These are huge in the States. So, I don't know what to tell you. I honestly have no idea what to expect. Um, it's a lot of hype. There's a ton of hype. And that's okay. That's okay. Hipsters get hype. Um... Uh, any worse than a hyped up beer but you know if there was ever a creation for the sup fuckers glass it's this one. Oh, that's bubbly so i don't know i like seltzer water by itself i have no expectation i'm not gonna judge until i try i know a lot of people got pissy about it and like well pe let people be excited about things so it does smell quite mangoey i'll give it that there's lots of carbonation going on let's get into it uh, cheers my friends my very first white claw and as they say Ain't no laws when you're drinking claws. Cheers. It's actually not half bad. I mean, it doesn't appeal to me personally. It's a little too sweet, but the mango flavor is there. It is a little tad medicinal, maybe. Maybe. <sighs> Here's the thing with this. It's 5% ABV. Um, it says it uses natural flavor, so that's good. It's not horrible. I don't know. Carbonated water, alcohol, cane sugar, natural flavor, citric acid. That's what's in it. It's very dry. Like, my mouth is really dry now. So, I don't know. It's gluten-free. So, it, it is what it is. There's a gram of carbs. I don't know. If that's your thing, you, you might like it. I would probably... It's not for me, but it's not horrid. It's just very weird because it's bubbly. And it does not taste like 5% alcohol. So, I mean, I suppose there's, there's there, that would be the clothes. For some reason, when I drink clothes, I think I'm from the South. Ain't no laws around here no more. We got the clothes. So I, I don't know where that comes from. I'm going to try them all. Um, Again, there's a market for this. And a very, very hot summer day. Like, it's sunny out. It's not super hot, but it's nice out. A very hot summer day. Crushing a few of these after mowing the lawn or something. Yeah, I could see it. You know? Uh, I know there's some Canadian versions coming out. Like, I know some breweries have hard seltzers coming. Some have already made them. I think Dominion City made one. I know Shackland's made one. So, again, it's something different. It's alcohol. And, well, if you like alcohol, another option for you. So, uh, cheers, my friends, to Claws. Apparently, there are no laws. Cheers. It's still weird. 